The best swimmers in the world taking lanes in downtown Indy. The crowds have never been bigger for a swim meet and the fanfare around Lucas Oil Stadium is something USA Swimming says it's never seen before. Eric Graves looks at how the city has rallied around the trials. Phenomenal. Indianapolis did it up. A few days into the U.S. Olympic swim trials and visitors say they're blown away. More than 20,000 people were on hand Saturday night and the crowds have stayed near that number. That's what is shocking to see that many people because like the biggest meets we've ever been to, maybe 3,000. Tim Henchy is the president of USA Swimming. For the first time, the organization is reaching beyond just a swim meet. Never before has a city built around the Olympic trials like this with an entire block party, fan fest, Eiffel Tower and swimming pools in Inside an NFL stadium. It's been a dream come true for all of us. Leaders at Indy will tell you it's all about the community rallying around its visitors. The Eiffel Tower is made by local welders. There are hundreds of volunteers. The Colts mascot Blue even got in on the action by jumping in the Olympic pool when it was unveiled. Multiple groups and people across the city are going out of their way to help promote the trials. That's what makes us such a great sports community is because we're such a great community at welcoming folks. There aren't any actual Indy cars in the pool, although there are some on Georgia Street, but former swimmer and IMS president Doug Bowles hasn't stopped himself from getting involved. I want to be part of this. It's a pretty epic moment for our community. We're one year away. A year ago, Bowles swam in the lake at IMS to remind people the trials were getting close. But I snuck in. Last week, he got an inflatable race car and paddled down the trials pool. The way that our city comes together for events is the secret sauce of this community. We are the sports capital of the world because of the community and the way we come together. Ultimately, it's leading to the biggest stages and biggest crowns ever for these athletes. A moment swim parents like Brett Noble say his daughter Kennedy and her competitors deserve. It just increases the moment that much more. Like everything feels more important, more significant. And more than 20,000 people were in attendance for night one on Saturday. The U.S. swimming president says they might have a chance to break that mark tomorrow.